Hi loves, it's Sam. So today I'm gonna to be sharing the biggest, yeah, probably the biggest Red Aspen haul you will ever see. And you're probably gonna be like, what the heck is wrong with her? <laughs> I used to use Kiss once COVID stopped or once COVID started and the nail salons all closed. I started doing Kiss Nails and I kept on finding that I really liked them. I thought they were really pretty, but there wasn't a whole bunch of variety. And I started to get to the point where every time I removed them, my, I, my nails would like rip or break and it was starting to get quite painful. I kept on seeing Carly Styles talk about her red aspen nails. And so I figured, hold on. I just ran all the way down to the end of the house and I'm a bit puffed out. I started seeing her talk about hers and I was like, I'm just going to I'm just going to try them out. So I bought my first pair. I think I bought like a couple of sets. And then I was like, "Whoa, Nelly, like what have I been missing out on?" And from there, it's just become like a full-on problem <laughs> because I literally am obsessed. I buy so many of them. I absolutely love them. I just cannot stop wearing them. They are so cute. So these ones are called Hey Girl Hey and two of the nails are sparkly and then the other ones are matte. They're super cute. So these ones are $15 and I have the other part of the collection to show you as well. But today I figured I would just show you everything that I have recently bought and got with my reward points and then I will be having a huge giveaway on Instagram for you guys. So be sure to go and follow me over there so that you guys can be or so that you guys can go and enter. It's just going to be a ton of my favorite things that you guys have the chance to win and then I'm probably also going to throw in some gift cards as well. I wanted to be able to like, you know, let you guys know that I appreciate you guys and um just kind of celebrate reaching 300,000 after all of these 11 and a half years. The very first ones are the ones that I'm wearing. So these are called Hey Girl all hay. I found that the short and the medium ones last the longest and every if you're not familiar with red aspen because I do get a lot of questions about people who are interested you get a nail glue a little cuticle pusher stick you get a nail file up here and then you get lots of different nails so you have a ton of different options in there so I get a lot of questions about smaller nail beds or wider nail beds there's always a ton extra once I do like this is the set I used and you could see how many nails were left in there. So it's really nice because they have a lot of different sizes. So most people, I don't want to say everyone because obviously everyone is different, but most people will be able to find their, their nail size in here. They do have petite sets if you have really, really tiny nails, but I have quite small nails um, and they fit me perfectly fine. The only problem with the petite sets is that they only have like two colors, I think, which is kind of a bummer. So if your nails are really, really tiny, um, I'm not, I'm talking like super, super tiny. I don't know. I, I don't know because obviously my nails are small, but they're not super duper tiny, but they do have petite sets. You can always give those a go, but you're not going to have a huge selection. But if your nails are wide, you're probably going to be able to find everything you need in here because they do have some really wide, um, nails in his in this as well so i absolutely love them it takes me 15 minutes and it's just so convenient this is 15 dollars. it lasts two weeks and it saves you going to the salon because then you don't have to drive there you don't have to sit there like it takes an hour to get your nails done it's way cheaper because i used to pay 60 dollars every two weeks or every three weeks to get my nails done and I found that they are the kindest as far as your nail health, like the quality of your actual nails that I have tried. Because I've tried gel polish, I've tried gel, and I've tried acrylic, and then I've tried the Kiss Nails. And out of everything that I've ever used, these ones are the least damaging. Obviously, nothing is ever going to be as healthy as your own natural nail. But if you're someone who has been used to getting acrylic or gel or gel polishes, and I don't know, it depends on where you live. Like some... For a while, our salon's closed, but now they're back open. Um, but that's why I was like, I'm just gonna stay out of the salons. I'm just gonna go ahead and do it myself. My nails were already weak because I was getting acrylics before. And so obviously when you go from having acrylics and then you take off your nails, it's like they're paper thin. And so it's really nice to be able to put something on that you can do at home. Hello. Hi, um, Luna just knocked down her food and water. Is it all a mess? Yeah. Okay, will you just get a towel? Well, I need to do work. Okay, well, I don't work. I don't pay any bills, so I'll come <laughs> I'll come help you. Okay, I'm back. The cat knocked the water and the food all over. It was just an absolute disaster. Okay, I don't even know where I was, but these ones are like a super pale yellow, and again, they have that same like matte and sparkly effect, but these ones are a rounded shape. So you can see they are a little bit longer. This is the medium, medium length boy oh boy so again exactly the same concept where you've got a few sparkly ones and then the rest are matte or are they 
No, I'm sorry. All of these are shiny, but then some of them are sparkly. These ones are $15 as well. So this is my my recent haul. I picked up two more of the Jenna Goes Coconuts. Now, these are their long sets, and they are so beautiful. So this is the long, and it's a coffin shape. Um, I will give you guys a heads up. I have never had a problem with the short nail dashes or the medium nail dashes not wearing well like they always look absolutely beautiful and they last me a full two weeks however i did notice with the long set and i've only tried one long set which was the jenico's Co or coconuts these ones didn't wear quite as well i noticed that i was getting a little bit of lift at the back um on a couple of the nails and i have the like i cannot stand it where you go to wash your hair and then your nails catch on your hair i've never had that problem with the nails that are short and the nails that are medium but for some reason when I wore these I went to wash my hair on day eight and they were snagging the back of my nail like my hair was getting stuck and I can't stand that so I just took them off in the shower and they came off really easily at eight days normally if I tried to remove the short nails at eight days I could not get them off so I don't think the length or the long length lasts as long as the short and medium so if you're a little rougher on your hands and you really do want to get your full two weeks and your full like money's worth i probably wouldn't go with the long ones but if you just like the look of long nails and you're like yeah i can handle a week like i would say they last really well for a week but then i noticed like after that the seventh eighth day i was like mm, they're not looking quite as good as usual and the whole nail the nail catching on the hair thing did it for me so i took them off but i still ordered more because i do really love them and i think they're absolutely gorgeous and they make your nails look so long and elegant and delightful but i wouldn't say these were you might be able to get two weeks but i'm gonna say a good solid week with these and then you might want to switch them out so not quite as co cost effective but absolutely gorgeous and i don't know how if that works for all of the long ones i'm going to assume it does just because obviously the longer your nails the more strain the more strain you're putting on the nails like you're going to catch things a little bit easier or you know if you're doing dishes there's you know, th there's more chance for them to bonk on things whereas like obviously short and medium they don't catch as much um so i think that's probably why that is but i've never had a problem with the short and medium they always last me two weeks and they never ever catch on my hair wild about you collection i think this is already sold out so that was a bummer but i bought all of these ones um and these ones are so darn cute i'm sad that they don't have them available anymore but if they ever come back in stock i will let you guys know on my instagram because they're darn cute so these ones are called trina's tortoise shell and unfortunately i don't see them on the website anymore but dang it those ones are short then this one a oh, leaping snow leopards lena oh my goodness i got two sets of these i will be giving one of these away to you guys these are so gorgeous. So this is the medium length. They are so beautiful in person, you guys. It looks like metallic, like gold um, flakes on here. It's so beautiful. So oh, I, I bought three of those. And then I also got the zebra. So I actually got these for the giveaway. I'm not really a zebra fan, but I know some people are. So those ones are a short dash. So I'm actually going to start putting these away because I got two of the Hey Girl Haze. I'm going to start putting a pile for you guys. So you'll be getting, this is the giveaway, a Hey Girl Hey, the Leaping Snow Leopards Lena, the Stripes on Stripes Xena. So <laughs> I'm gonna give you a Jenna's, Jenna Goes Coconuts as well. You guys are gonna have so many nails. I got two of the tortoise shells, so I'll give you guys one of those as well. Steel Gray Shea, and I'm pretty sure I have one of these already. Anything that I already have like numerous ones of, I will, I'll put in the giveaway. Um, so those ones are short, they are gorgeous, just a really soft gray color. Then we have this one, Ferris Fancy Fascinator. How gorgeous are these? And most of these range from 15 to 16 dollars, or I'm sorry, 13 to 16 dollars. So I've noticed that the longer ones are usually 16 and the short ones are usually 13 or 15, depending on just which ones they are. This is Allie's Black Tie Affair. Look how gorgeous those are. I love the ones that have the little uh, accent nail of sparkle. They're just so pretty. We have some highlighters. So this one is Gold Crown, and I did get extras for you guys so that um, you guys can try it as well. So I actually, I opened the Gold Crown. I got one for myself, and I realized, like, this is actually really dark. So this is definitely more for a deeper skin tone, but this is the Gold Crown. So you can see, I don't know, maybe it would work, but... I'm just feeling like it's so dark. Like, let me try and get up close for you guys. There we go. 
it's almost like a bronzer. Let me just turn off this light. Do you guys see how dark that is? So for me, I just don't think it would be a highlight. So I don't know if I should keep one for myself or just give it away, but the, I suppose I should. I'll just keep one for myself so I can swatch it for you guys. Um, I could always use it as a little glow on the chest. Yeah, okay, I'll swatch it. I'll just swatch it because you never know. So that is Gold Crown. Actually, it's not quite as dark as I thought. It looks really dark when you see it in the packaging, but there is the actual color of it. So you can see it is pretty dark for a highlight. So if you have a deeper skin tone, this would be perfect for you. It's kind of like a nice, true, like rosy gold. It's actually really, really beautiful. So I'll keep that one for myself. It might be really pretty on the chest. But I also got one for you guys. And the packaging is really cute, by the way. I didn't even show you it. These highlighters are so beautiful. What I love about them is that they do not clog your pores. They do not enhance your texture. They're so creamy and kind of like, almost like dewy looking on the skin, but they are a powder. So see, this is what I'm wearing. I'm wearing the Pearl Crown, which I'll show you um, the difference in the two colors. And they do come with a good size mirror as well. So great for traveling if you need a mirror. So that's the difference in the colors. So you can see it's quite a huge difference as far as the colors go. So this is Pearl Crown. That's the one that I use every single time I do my makeup. And then that is the Gold Crown. So Gold Crown is definitely gonna be more for someone who is a deeper skin tone, who is either really, really tan or uh, you know of just a deeper skin tone in general. And then Pearl Crown is gonna be the one that you're gonna wear if you are my color or lighter. And I like a really bright highlight, but you can see it's so buttery. Like when I swatch it, just, I. I mean, hello, look at that. It is the best highlighter I have ever used. And you know what's crazy is like their prices for their highlighters are very reasonable. They're in the 20s. They are so good, you get so much product. And they also have a lot of um, benefits to them as well. So they have aspen bark, which helps smooths. You have hyaluronic acid to hydrate. Vitamin E protects from free radicals. Sunflower oil promotes regeneration and cornstarch provides a silky texture. And all of their stuff is cruelty free. So these are just such a, it's honestly, I have it on the tip of my nose. I have it down here. I have it in my inner corner and I have it as my highlight. So every time that you see me wearing a highlight, this is what I'm wearing. Those are those, I absolutely love them. So you guys will be winning one, one pearl crown and one gold crown. So put that aside for you guys. I got the Avery's Brow Pencil. I tried this out, I have to be honest, I think it's nice, but I prefer my L'Oreal one. So for me, I'm always gonna be honest with you guys, like if I don't like something 100%, I'll tell you. I think it is a nice, a nice eyebrow pencil, but I just think that for the price that I can get the L'Oreal one for, please hold, there we go. Um, I would prefer to get the L'Oreal because I just feel like it does better. Also, this does come with a little spoolie and I don't know if it's gonna change if, um, you know, obviously if you get a different color, maybe it's better. I just found that the color was a little bit ashy for me and the wand was a bit stiff. So it's kind of a little bit hard to get the product out. Like it's quite dry. And for some reason when I put it on my eyebrows, it just looked a little bit ashy. Like the color just wasn't wasn't there if I was in a pinch I could totally use it it wasn't terrible I just think the L'Oreal one is a better color for me personally so I think they're nice I think it just it's really hard to find a good blonde eyebrow pencil but they do have eyebrow pencils in different shades so if you're brunette maybe you would like it I just felt like for me it was just a tiny bit ashy then we have some lip liners so I have contour with grace chocolate 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 ah, cosmos I have peony which is a pink and then I have the Blushing Dahlia, which I actually already own. So let me get my lip liners out here. The Blushing Dahlia is probably my favorite color. Look how gorgeous that is. It's such a pretty kind of like peachy, kind of peachy rosy color. It's so pretty, pretty in the summertime and spring. So you guys will be winning the Blushing Dahlia because I already have that. And you'll also be getting the, no, I already have that one. I don't think I have Chocolate Cosmos, do I? I don't even know, I don't have Peony. Peony is like a really light pink. I'm not gonna swatch these because I planned on giving these away to you guys. I just think for me, Chocolate Cosmos is a little, I can't get it out, a little dark. It's pretty, pretty dark if I, oh dear, I can't get it out. Wow, it's really stuck in there. Well, anyway, 
it's pretty dark. I mean, the color is usually pretty true to what it shows on the box. So I'm going to be giving this one and the, pe the peony away as well as the blushing Dahlia to you guys. So you'll get to win three lip liners and their lip liners are so creamy. They just glide on. They stay on all day. They're moisturizing. They're so, so beautiful. So I got to figure out my piles here so that I don't mess up. Um, they're just such a beautiful lip liner. I highly recommend them. I got some little mini lash scissors. So I got two of these. I actually don't have a pair. So one of them is for myself, which I will show you. And then one of them I'm going to give away to you guys. I just figured since I had so many rewards, I might as well just like gift you guys. And like, I mean, it's, you know, a ton of money's worth of stuff. And then you guys have a nice little present from me. So these are cute little lash scissors. They're kind of curved. So great for lashes. Um, so I'm going to keep those and then you guys will have your very own set. I also got two ultimate pencil sharpeners. So these are great for the lip liners. So I'll show you guys the one that I'm going to keep. Oh, this is cute. How adorable. So you've got your large size on this. Look at that. That's massive. Let me just, here we go. We have a large size one here. And oh, this is so cute. What a convenient little doodad. And then we've got your small size on that side. So this is, and you can buy these on the, on the website. I think they're really affordable. I'm going to put the prices and links for everything in the description box. I can't remember because honestly, I got a lot of stuff. So, but I think it was like $10 maybe, maybe less, but you guys will be winning one of these as well. And then we have a bunch more nails. So get ready. So we've got more of the, uh, Jenna goes coconuts. I like literally went crazy. I went coconuts with these. I love them. I just think they're so beautiful. I got a ton of the Bonjour Julie. These are my favorite. I have to have like a huge stash of them because they are the most elegant, classy, classic everyday nail it matches with everything if you're going to a wedding if you're going to it just doesn't matter what you're doing they just look so beautiful so i got a ton of these to like keep um and i will be giving you guys a pair so this is what the bonjour julie looks like these i would oh that one's all mangled hold on that one got flipped around oh that one got flipped around as well miss Lil was playing with these she was stacking <laughs> stacking towers um, but that's what they look like they look absolutely gorgeous on if you go to my instagram you can see them in person they, I have like a highlight, a red aspen highlight where I save all of the ones that I've used. Um, they are just, it, it's just an everyday nail. Like no matter what you're wearing, no matter what you're doing, they look beautiful. This is the medium length. I believe these are 15. If I'm, again, I'll put the price in the description box. They lasted me full two weeks. They are so elegant on the fingers. Like if you are looking to start red aspen for the first time and you're like, I don't really know like what I should go with go with the Bonjour Julie. They are so pretty on. They just look so expensive and classy and elegant and they just elongate your fingers. They are absolutely gorgeous. So I absolutely love Bonjour Julie. I would highly recommend it to anyone. Um, I'll be putting one of those aside for you guys as well. But yeah, they are just beautiful. Okay, then we have Marshmallow. These ones are super duper cute. Um, they are like a really pretty kind of like almost like a a mauve nude shade they're so cute also really pretty to mix up with like the leopard print ones the leopard for lydia or you can mix and match any of the nails so it doesn't matter what set you get if you're getting medium obviously mix with the medium if you're getting short mix with a short however all of these nails are you're able to cut and file to the length that you like so let's just say you're like Oh, I love the color of Jenna Goes Coconuts, but I'm not about the long, the long nail life. You can actually cut them down with regular nail clippers and file them to the shape that you want, and they are perfect. I've tried it. I've done it with numerous nails. It doesn't break them. It doesn't damage them. So any of these are adjustable. So if you see a color that you love, but it's not in the short nail, get it in the long, cut it down. It works perfectly. And then you always have extra nails, so always keep your boxes with all the extra nails because then you can mix and match with like once you say you do a full set of this and every single color is the same on your nail you'll have a ton left over so then save those extra nails save all the glue save the sticks and then you guys can actually mix and match with other minis as you use other sets you'll have little extras left over and then you can mix and match and create your own little rainbow nail so absolutely love that color i think it's really gorgeous i'm gonna give one of these to you guys these are called Violetta's Vintage Amethyst, and some of these are ones that I was able to get like as a limited, or th I think 
This one is the actual um, February February loyalty box. So that's just a box. It's like um, you can't buy these nails. It comes every month and it's a different set of nails every month that you cannot buy on the website. So it's only for the loyalty box. So I think, I can't remember if it was Lilacs for Lily or Rocky Mountain Iris, but it came with two, or maybe it was three. I can't remember. But anyway, this one is Rocky Mountain Iris. So these are like a really dark purple which are really, really beautiful. And then these ones are lilacs for Lily and they're like a really pretty lilac color. So super gorgeous, light purple. There we go. Then we have Winter's Wonderland. These are gorgeous. I actually have a few of these already, so I'll be gifting you guys one of these in the giveaway. Let me just try and, I feel like it focuses better. Yeah, there we go. So those ones are like a really, really pale lilac and then you get the sparkly accent color which is kind of like a chunky sparkle. It's absolutely gorgeous. So gifting you guys one of those as well. Harper's Picks Peonies. These are so cute. If you like a really nice, fun, bright pink, these would be great for summer. They are, again, a short nail dash. Really, really fun and vibrant. So you'll be winning one of those. We've got some really gorgeous, like more fall toned ones. These are really pretty for, I'm saving them for autumn but we have Fall for Christine, which is like a really pretty kind of like burgundy-ish. It's like a color of a leaf. And then Liza loves a latte, really gorgeous nude, kind of like light kind of coffee brown color. So those are really pretty, those are both short. So then these ones were limited, unfortunately, I don't think you can find them anymore, um, but they are the X's and O's Esme. I'm pretty sure I have another set of these. If I do, I'll be giving you guys one of these. I don't want to say for sure, but I think I have a set already. But these are a medium one, and they're so beautiful. They're so cute. They're like little lines going through the nails. And then I did get numerous ones of these. These are called the Arlindas Next in Line. Look how cute these are. So those ones are so pretty. I love them. They're medium again, and they have like all those fun different lines. So it's super cute. Just a really fun way to mix. And this would be really cute with black. Like if you mixed it with a black nail dash, oh, so adorable. So you guys will be winning one of those as well. And this giveaway is going to be on my Instagram. Just go over to my Instagram. You can follow me on there and then I can easily DM you. It just makes it a lot more convenient for me um, that way. And then that way you guys can stalk me on Instagram too. Okay, then we have these ones. These are Gorge. They're Marvelous Mabel in pink. Look at these. They're like a really pretty white and pink medium nail dash in a, like a marble design. So you guys will be winning one of those as well. You guys are going to be hooked up for life. I wonder if I should separate it into two... No, I'm just gonna do a huge grand prize. Um, these ones are Gorge. These are the Skylar's Ski... Skylar's Ski... Skylar's Ski's Black Diamond. Yes. Hi. I can't read. They're super sparkly, like big chunky gray sparkle. This would be gorgeous mixed with like a black nail dash, even like a navy blue as like an accent nail. They're so cute. We have tulips for Tiffany. These are super cute. If you just like a nice, simple, classic red nail, tulips for that's a mouthful. Tulips for Tiffany are really pretty red short nail dash. It's a true like classic red. So you guys will be getting one of those. Also, I got this color for you guys. I don't really care for it, but I know a lot of people do really like that kind of muted green. This is called Woodland Forest and it's like a really muted kind of like, I guess it's like a khaki green. I just don't know if I'll ever wear it. So I figured I would just give that to you guys because um, I don't really, I don't wear green a whole lot think pink these are really pretty it's kind of like a soft rosy pink color and these are a medium length they're really really gorgeous so you guys will be winning one of those because I got two of those okay then we have Pippa in pink leopard these are a, a medium nail dash as well they're so cute I love these I think I feel like these are so fun for summer with like a hot pink so you could do an accent nail like this um, like this one and that one and then the rest would be like a hot pink I think that would be so cute or even a nude because they're nude with hot pink and black so you guys will be I can't even talk you'll be winning one of those these are leopard for Lydia this is one of my first sets I ever did these are so cute if you mix and match with a pink or a white or a black or you can do all three they are just absolutely gorgeous these are a short nail dash and they just look so darn cute on so i'm gonna gift you guys one of those and we have penny is golden 
Look how cute these are. Oh my gosh, they're like a big chunky gold glitter. Again, these are a short nail dash. They look gorgeous with pink, red. They're fabulous around the holidays. They're just so darn cute. So I'll be giving you guys one of those as well. Then we have Heidi, what is this called? Heidi Canyon, Heidi Hiked Canyon Loop. So these ones are like a really pretty kind of mauve nude color, but these are a medium length and they are so beautiful. Just a really nice kind of nude shade. So you'll be getting one of those as well. Sometimes you feel like a short nail and sometimes you feel like a medium one. Like I was wearing the long ones and now I'm wearing the short ones and it's kind of nice to like have the break of having a long nail. But then sometimes like, oh, I really want to like feel like super fancy and girly and then I get a long one. So you can switch it up and it's so fun and easy to do. Okay, then we have Allison's little black dress. So these are a medium one. These would be cute mixed with that um, leopard one, the longer leopard one with the neon. So cute. They're just a plain shiny black so you'll be winning one of those as well you guys can have this one as well this one is called desert Halley. it's really really pretty it's like a really like deep kind of yeah it's like a deep purple i just never wear purple very often like this color purple so i'll give those ones to you guys as well because i know there's someone probably like it more than i do and then this one is called red rock canyon remy these ones are really cute they're red medium nail dash and then they have those little um, gems, like the little rhinestones. Unfortunately, I did not get two of those. Oh, I should have, but I'm keeping those ones. Then we have Halo Effect. I only got one of these as well. I don't know what I was thinking. These are, I didn't know if I was gonna like them. And then I got them in person and I was like, what? That's what I've discovered is that a lot of the times you order it and you're like, I don't know, they might be cute. And then you get it and they're so much prettier in person. It's so difficult to photograph, I'm sure. But these are called Halo Effect. They're a medium one. They are absolutely spectacular. Like look how, here, I'll focus it. There we go. They're like a really pretty champagne-y nude with like tons of golden sparkles. They're absolutely gorgeous. I don't know why I didn't order. I didn't know if this was gonna be cute, so I didn't order numerous ones, but I should have. But I'm keeping those. What is this one called? Annie's at opening night. Oh my gosh, you guys. Look how pretty these are. So these ones are a long nail dash, and they are a coffin, and they are just like that really pretty, I guess it's kind of like a mop, isn't it? So you guys will be winning one of those. Then we have vintage black again a long coffin shaped nail these ones are so gorgeous they're kind of sexy a little bit sultry really really beautiful and they look like they have like black lace layered over it so this is a long nail dash you guys will be winning one of those as well those are cute i haven't tried them yet but they look amazing oh i love these ones so much these ones are super pretty these are called cami wears khaki and they're like a really really light kind of like mauve tone Again, more on that nude shade. There we go. See, they're kind of like a really, really light mob. These ones are a long length as well. They're kind of a little bit more almond shaped versus the coffin. They're really, really beautiful. So you'll be winning one of those. I think I found an extra Liza Loves a Latte. I think I have one already. So if I do have the extra one, I'll give those ones to you guys as well. Let's double check because I can't remember what all I've shown now. Um, okay, next we have Winnie's and White Sands. These are one of my favorite colors. They're such a great everyday classic short nail dash. They're really, really creamy. So you can see this is the Hey Girl Hey. They're a little bit more nude and creamier than a typical pink. They're like just lovely on. They look so classic and elegant. They are just so beautiful to mix and match with the leopard, with white. They're just super cute. So those ones are gorge. Um, I'm gonna give one of those to you guys as well. Then we have Nina on Cloud Nine. Now Nina on Cloud Nine is a plain white. They have it in a short as well as a long coffin. So these ones are gorgeous to mix and match or if you just want the whole white you know, look, then you can do that as well. They're really pretty. I've, I've uh, worn Nina on Cloud Nine before. They look absolutely gorgeous, especially when you have a good self tan. They look amazing. So you guys will be winning one of those. So these are really fun to mix and match, maybe with that black lace or with one of the mauve colors. Um, they just are so beautiful. So you'll getting you'll be getting one of those as well. Then we have Catherine and the ballet slipper. This is one of my favorites as well. It's a really great classic. So this one is like a, I'm going to hold it up against the hay girl hay so you guys can see the difference. Again, very, very pale pink, 
but you can see it's a little bit creamier, not quite as like baby pink as the Hey Girl Hey. It's just a little softer and it's also the shiny nails. So those are really beautiful. If you just, if you like OPI bubble bath, like in a gel polish, you will absolutely love Catherine and the Ballet Slipper because it's a really, really similar um, color to OPI bubble bath, which is what I always used to get when I got gel polish. It's really cute and you'll be winning one of these and it just is like a all, it's like a great every Every day no matter where you're going no matter what you're wearing it just looks really pretty and classic and elegant then we have another long one this is called Karen is tickled pink and this is a long coffin light pink nail so you can see that is the color so you'll be winning one of those as well oh this is the steel gray shea coffin cute I only got one of these unfortunately so I'm keeping these but um really cute to mix and match with other coffin nails. Those are all the nail dashes. And then I bought some palettes. I bought some for friends and one for you guys. So I bought one of the Courageous palette. Now I actually don't own this one and I was contemplating whether I should keep it or not. But the truth is I don't think I'm going to wear it because I just don't wear bright colors anymore. I should probably keep it, but I just feel like I just don't really like wear bright colors. So I don't know if I, sh I feel like it'd be best to just give it to you guys. But this is the Courageous palette. Now the thing about their eyeshadow palettes and I completely agree because I've seen comments about it like, dude, that is ridiculously expensive. What on earth? I felt the same way when I first got mine and I was like, that's so expensive. Like it better be dilly dang good. Now you guys know I have a real sensitive eye. So most shadows I cannot wear anymore. It makes my eyes stream all day long. It's so annoying. They just get so watery and so like red and sore that I just I don't even wanna wear eyeshadow. This red Aspen palette I've had for, I think I got it back in March of last year. So I've had it for a year. I've hardly like even made a dent. It lasts so long. The colors are humongous. Like you get a lot of product. They do not bother my eyes at all. I can wear it all day long. I can sleep in it. I never have a watery eye. And they're so pigmented and so beautiful and they blend out so well. The colors are absolutely gorgeous. However, I have not tried the Courageous one just because I never wear these colors. But they are truly gorgeous, like so pretty. So if you are someone who likes brighter shades, then this would definitely be the palette for you guys. And then the whole entire front of it is like a gold and it feels like kind of like a like a faux leather or something it's a really beautiful palette they are definitely worth the money it is pricey i'm not gonna lie and be like no it's really affordable it's the most expensive thing that they offer because i feel like everything else that they offer is very affordable but the palettes are really pricey, but they are so quality. The actual palette itself is great. The mirror is huge. Like it's just such a great everyday palette. So Courage is obviously a little bright, but you guys will be winning this one because I just don't think I'll end up using it because I just won't. And then you'll be getting a brand new Fulfilled palette as well. So this one is my favorite. This is what I use every single time I do my makeup. It's what I'm wearing every single time anyone asks, what are you wearing? I always have this on no matter what. Um, so again, it's like that really beautiful kind of like faux leather feel. It feels just creamy dreamy. It's delightful. Um, and then it's massive. And again, these are cruelty free you guys. So it makes you feel good when you're using it. Massive mirror. It's humongous and it folds all the way back, which is really great. Um, and these are all of the colors that you get inside of it. So this color here, I'll show you in the brand new palette. This one is my absolute favorite for highlighting, um, because it is so beaming. It's perfect for the inner corner, but then I use this color right here, which is called embrace. And then I use this one right here, which is called exhale. And then I use this one right here, which is called purpose. I mix all three of those together in my crease. So that's what I'm always wearing in my crease. And then I use home for my little like shadow wing. Cause I cannot do liquid liner anymore because my eyes just, they make it look bent and mangled. Um, so I use home in that section, love, grace, soul. Look how pretty those are. I mean, the pigment of these is insane. Um, this one right here, they're just so beautiful, but like, look at the, even the mattes when you swatch are just so pigmented. Like they're amazing. I just absolutely love this palette. I cannot say enough good things about it. And because my eyes are so sensitive, I cannot use other palettes anymore. I literally have hundreds of eyeshadow palettes 
and I try to use them and my eyes starts watering. So I have just stuck to my good old Fulfilled. I'll show you the brand new one. Let me make sure my hands are really clean because I don't want to get the box all dirty. Um, because the little highlighter color in there, it's called Bliss. It's spectacular. I used to, it, mine broke when we moved. I don't know how because it was with me, but somehow it broke. But it's great for the inner corner or to like highlight the brow bone. It's just absolutely woo, beautiful. So Bliss is really shimmery and beautiful and amazing. So that's what it looks like when it's brand new. It's absolute perfection. And you guys will be winning that as well. So you guys have got a highlighter in both colors. You've got an eyeshadow palette in both colors. And you have got so many nails. You've got lip liners. Oh, actually, I have a, a couple of other things that I've been saving for you guys as well. We also have the Pump It Up Maggie Mascara. So I have one my, myself. This is a really beautiful mascara. It's not my absolute favorite, but I do think it does a really great job of um, making your lashes look massive. I just prefer the one I always use, but this is what the wand looks like. So it is a good mascara. Like, I'm not gonna say it's not. Why isn't it focusing? There we go. I just have other ones that I prefer more. So you guys will be winning one of those. I've seen it used on Carly and I'm like, dude, her lashes must be insane because they look so great. Like she does these videos with it and I'm like, what on earth? Like her lashes look just delightful. Yay, we do have berry bouquet. So I ordered one specifically for the giveaway and then freaking Fiona, the little jerk face, comes in here without me knowing. I was busy in here doing stuff. She stole the entire box, the brand new box, took it under my bed and chewed up the entire lip liner and there was just lip liner all over the carpet underneath my bed. So. Luckily, I have an extra one, so you guys will be winning that as well. And let me just swatch Berry Bouquet for you guys. So it's a really pretty, like, raspberry tone. It's so gorgeous. It's so creamy. My voice just broke there. It's just absolutely lovely. So you'll be winning one of those. And you'll also be winning Ashes Ink Liner. I have not tried it because I hate liquid liner, but I've seen people use it and... They swear by it and it looks really, really great. Um, Carly Styles uses this a lot in her videos and it looks lovely. I just don't use liquid liner. I don't like the way it looks on me. So you'll be winning those as well. And you'll also be winning a little Berry Bouquet liquid lipstick as well. So this is the exact same color. It's a liquid lipstick that goes with that lip liner. Okay guys, so that is everything. That is all of the stuff that I recently got. Like I said, it's a mixture of me buying, it's like orders that I've bought myself, and then orders that I have made with my rewards that I have earned, and I just figured it would be the perfect way for me to gift back to you guys, to thank you guys for being my subscribers, and for all of your sweet comments, and for your support over the years. And if you're new, Cool Beans, thank you so much for being here and following me. I just appreciate you guys so much, and I have such a great... Like I have such a great group of people that follow me and I love when I get to interact with you guys on Instagram and you guys DM me. So I'm really active on Instagram. I try to reply to all of my comments on YouTube, but obviously I, when the video first goes up, then I'll reply. But then obviously as, as you make more and more videos, I, I can't, I don't have the time to go back and reply to all of my comments on every single video I've ever made because I have thousands. Um, so for me, it's a really easy way to connect with you guys on Instagram because then you can DM me and it's the first thing I check in the morning and I try to reply to everybody and if you have questions or you need links or anything like that it's a really great way to get a hold of me so always show, go check on my Instagram and I do a lot of Starbucks giveaways on there so I just have I, I'm a lot more active on my Instagram because it's easier for me and my time is very limited nowadays so for me, Instagram is just an easier way for me to connect with you guys and show you guys what I'm doing and show you guys new things I'm getting and share my favorite things with you guys because YouTube is such a production, it takes a ton of my time and so I don't get to put out as much content as I would like on YouTube as I can on Instagram because it's just so quick. So um, be sure to follow me on Instagram if you haven't. If you don't have an Instagram, you're missing out. Get an Instagram, like do it because I love Instagram so much. Like it's my favorite thing. It's like, it's just so fun. If you don't have an Instagram and you want to enter this giveaway, you will need to get an Instagram to enter this giveaway. And I'm really sorry, it's just, it makes it so much easier for me to check that you guys 
are actually following me and I can DM you easily and it just makes everything really streamlined. So make sure that you guys follow me on Instagram. It is at Sam Sherman. Um, and then I will have all of the rules for the giveaway in that actual post. Don't forget to check out the description box. I will have links to everything here. So if you're like, you know what? I don't want to wait for this giveaway and hope I win. I just want to buy some of these nails. I'll have them all listed down below with the prices that each one are. If they are not, some of these might've been limited, so you're not able to buy them, but a lot of them are still available. So I will link all of the ones that are obviously available. And then I'll just link the website to Red Aspen as well so that you guys can just check out because they have so much cute stuff. They have a ton of false lashes. Like they just have great products. And literally everything that I have tried so far, I have absolutely loved except the mascara and the eyebrow pencil. The mascara is good. I'm not going to say it's bad. It's just I really like the mascara that I've been using for years. And then this eyebrow pencil, good. Not the best I've ever used, but it is good. So it really just depends on your hair color, I think, um, because for me, it was just the tone that wasn't completely there. I feel like when I do too ashy, it kind of makes me look a little older. So I have to have like the, the right amount of ash without being too ashy, if you know what I mean. Thank you guys, I love you. I have some really fun um, try-ons coming up. I keep on seeing all these dad jean trends and I'm like, I don't know about this because obviously I'm short. I'm five, one and a half because I shrunk, which sucks. And I'm really curvy. I have really big hips. I have a bum. I have big thighs. My calves are pretty, pretty big as well. Like just in general, I'm like, I'm very curvy. So I'm really interested because I keep on seeing it on all these tall, skinny people and I'm like, okay, well, yeah, everything looks great on you. But what about a short curvy girl? So I have ordered a ton of different ones. We're gonna put them to the test. I don't even know what size I am in them because they kind of look like you have to size up. So I sized up. I don't know what's gonna happen. I am really intrigued. I'm slightly nervous, but I'm gonna be trying them all on for you guys and we'll see what kind of hot mess it is. Or maybe it'll be amazing. We don't know. I just don't know about this trend. I don't know if it's gonna work on my figure. So we shall see. So that'll be coming up. I think they arrive next week. So sometime next week, it'll be coming up. I ordered more Honey Love stuff. So I'm excited because I love those tanks. I literally live in them. So I ordered some like shorts and undies and bras and all sorts of different ones. So that'll be coming up at the end of March. So I've got some really fun content. I, I just love spring. Spring for me is my favorite because I just feel like the content is just so fun and fresh and new and you're like getting ready for the, the lovely weather. And I don't know, it just makes me really happy. So stay tuned for all of those videos, but thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to enter that giveaway. And I love you guys very, very much. Thank you. Mwah.